For those of you following the Rachel Morin case, her killer is still out there, roaming free. It's been three months since Rachel was found dead on the popular hiking Ma and Pa Trail. Rachel's family are now searching for answers across the country. The family is worried that as time goes by, leads will go cold, and the case may not be in people's mind. After releasing thousands of flyers locally describing the suspected killer, they are now extending their push for answers to Los Angeles, California, where DNA evidence linked Rachel Morin's killer to an unsolved home invasion back in March. It's where the suspect was captured on a surveillance camera as he exited the home. It's believed that Rachel Morin's family has been going door to door in California searching for answers. Because this has not been as prevalent in California as it has been in Maryland, they decided they are going to go straight to the doorsteps of the individuals that reside around the house in Los Angeles County, where the crime occurred. They are constantly sitting down and thinking what more they can do. The family feel frustrated as they have not been hearing much from the police. However, the sheriff says that several new leads are being pursued behind the scenes. Tips are still pouring in. This is quite serious. There is a violent killer out there, on the loose. He needs to be caught. Three months have gone by already, and I can totally understand the family's extreme frustration.